Let's take a quick look at the NordVPN threat protection. Is it working again? Looks like it is. So if you want to re reapply it, re-enable it on your system, it looks like it's back to working properly. It's not using 100% of the CPU, not causing the constant disconnects from the internet, and not hogging up all the system resources on the entire system. So it looks like it's back to working properly. If you want to give it a try on your system, make sure that you're running the most recent update. In this case, we have NordVPN 7.4.7.0. Since NordVPN doesn't have the manual update button within the desktop client, the best thing to do is close the desktop client, restart Windows. If it updates, it probably will ask you to re-log back into the NordVPN client. That's kind of an indicator that it updates. They're updating. Leaves a little bit to be desired because it doesn't even tell you. <laughs> it doesn't have an update log or anything like that. It just kind of secretly updates. And I guess you find out if you have to log in again. So if you have to log in again, it's a good indicator that it probably updated. Now, when you log in, it takes you to the browser. It cross talks from the browser to the desktop utility. It'll ask you to continue in the app. In this case, we did click continue in the app and the app just kept saying to log in. We tried it two or three different browsers. It kept doing the same thing. So what we did is we closed the desktop utility, reopened it, and we were magically logged in. So if you're having problems logging in, try to close the desktop utility see if that helps get you re-logged into the app and we tested it pretty thoroughly opened like 300 tabs eight different windows on a chrome browser a steam client a bunch of tabs in firefox email it didn't start ratcheting the cpu usage up like it was doing on the previous version the version that was having the issue was nordvpn version 7.4.6.0 so if you want to check the version and open the desktop utility dashboard Go to the left tab strip all the way to the bottom, click the gear icon, and just below the settings title on the top of that settings page, you should see the NordVPN version that you're currently running. If it's still on 7.4.6.0, try to restart the system, and hopefully NordVPN will automatically update. The version you want to be running to get the threat protection working is version 7.4.7.0. So this helps identify the current working condition of NordVPN's threat protection feature on your system as well.